so I don't feel like lighting another coal to smoke in this video, but um, essentially McDonald's is upset because of the mistreatment of little chickies on um, the ranches. Now mind you, this is one of the biggest uh, chicken farms in the country. How do you think they're going to treat their animals? Do you think they got to be the biggest chicken farm by being nice to their chickens? and you know letting them run free range no that's not how farming works if you're opposed to animal cruelty it would stand to reason you would not want to endorse chicken farming to begin with you cannot say that there's a moderate ground uh... the only way these farmers are going to be able to produce enough meat in order to feed your fat ass is in order to breed them at an exorbitant rate and pump hormones into them and kill them as soon as they reach a certain age and you know and chain them up and uh, make sure that their muscles don't um, grow and develop and they're soft and tender that's how you get the tasty chicken uh, wings and the tasty chicken burgers and shit how do, how do you think that stuff is made are you five so McDonald's and a couple of other places are pissed off at these oh they're supposedly pissed off what they mean to say is they want you to think they have some moral integrity and they'll get your money that way and they're pissed off at these farmers for being cruel to their chickens now where is McDonald's priorities they exploit the third world they're polluting the world with uh, all the all their factories and all this garbage that they create with their paper food and uh, the biodegradable cardboard boxes and shit. Uh, they don't care about their workers. They give them a non-livable wage and treat them like shit. They have their souls sucked out of them, having to do a stressful job behind the grill or behind the cash register. Uh, you know they don't care about marketing fatty foods towards children and making the obesity rates grow up uh, go up uh, you know they don't care about your children their workers the people of the third world the people in this country they don't care about any of that but they care about the little chickens getting abused y you uh, what is wrong with you people do you think McDonald's is showing any integrity here by, uh, you know, opposing the big farmers? Ooh, uh, you know, I'm not saying what the farmers are doing are right, but nothing is right about the capitalist system. It wouldn't matter if it was the farmers getting flack or McDonald's. I, in fact, I would rather McDonald's get the flack because McDonald's is bigger than the farmers. McDonald's encompasses the entire world. There's a McDonald's in every fucking place you go. It doesn't matter where you go. You could get on a plane, and, and I bet there's McDonald's in fucking Zimbabwe. They don't have the money to afford the McDonald's food, but I bet there's a McDonald's there. So that's all I'm trying to say here is you have to prioritize what you think needs to be done and while I feel sorry for the animals and I think it's wrong what they do to them it, it is not my main concern it is not my main con uh, concern to worry about the needs of an inferior creature that could not uh, you know it does not know good and evil chickens do not perceive the world in the same way humans do and you know I'm I'm not one of these liberal leftists that think you know we have to liberate all living things not just humanity because it, they literally cannot most humans cannot perceive good and evil that's why I don't focus on you know oh this person got abused Woo -hoo -hoo. I don't care because they're stupid and they're evil and they're murderous lying sacks of shit so you know, I, I don't I don't care. I don't listen to them. I don't worry about their problems. I got 99 problems and a bitch ain't one. That's the way I look at it. You know, I got my own problems to worry about and I got my own issues that I'm concerned with and it just shows that this is disinformation. This is deviating you from the real concerns. You're losing your house. You're losing your family. You're losing your integrity and your life to these rich assholes but you're gonna worry about the little chickens being in the tight cages really so that's all I have to say